Alex Fasano alongside Ian Sachs, where the Iona Gales just dropped a hard-fought matchup against the Quinnipiac Bobcats 14-13 in overtime. Ian, we saw the Gales heading into the half up 10-9, but before that, they were down 5, a 9-4 deficit, and then 8 straight goals from the Gales. Ian, what did we see from the ladies that impressed you? They're fight in this one was so impressive they could have just given up when they were down five goals they're already 0-2 in the max schedule but so much fight in this team to battle back to take the lead to try to get their first MAC win of the season just coming up a tiny bit short but then they even had the lead in the final minute of the game but to see the Quinnipiac equalizer go in the goal and then 30 seconds into overtime it all ended for, uh, for Iona. Leading the way for the Gales was Jenna Tolzman with four goals, followed behind Aaron Pugh with three. What did you see from these upperclassmen that really stood out in this game? Well, it's the senior leadership, and Coach Mason spoke about it after the game, saying that they're the ones showing the rope to the younger players, and they're leading the way both on the stat sheet and not on the stat sheet, doing the little things that teaching the younger players what needs to be done in order to win in the conference. We're so upperclassmen right now, so I think them every day, it's just, it's just challenging them and, and, and working upperclassmen, making them better, and then taking advantage of their opportunity. You know? Looking ahead, Ian, the Gales take on the Siena Saints on Saturday. What did you see from today's matchup that they're going to have to carry into this weekend? Well, two things. They're going to have to continue to rely on their veteran leaders that you mentioned earlier, and Jenna Tolzman and Aaron Pugh. And then they're going to have to get Pamela Giordano, the team's leading scorer, more shots, more opportunities. She just had two goals in this game. Well, Iona looking to snap a five-game losing streak heading into this weekend. That wraps things up here from Mazzella Field. I'm Alex Fasano. Easy in sacks. And we'll see you next time.